Hey fellow travelers, it's Jenny from Repeatable. Repeatable helps you solve the problem of packing your quart bag when you're flying carry-on. Today I wanna to tell you about the name Repeatable, about where it came from, and why there's no E on the end of the name. I've been asked this a lot, so I wanna explain this today. So the whole idea from Repe of Repeatable came several years ago when I was traveling every week as a business consultant. I was the person that would get up at 3 a.m. on Monday morning, get back at around midnight on Thursday night, and during that time of my life, basically everything was on an assembly line because I was only home for a short amount of time and I was right back on the road again flying out to my consulting job. So what I really needed at that time and what I wanted to develop was a repeatable process because I didn't have time each week to think through different things. I mean, things had to be on a schedule and they had a, it was a go, go, go type lifestyle. So that's where the name repeatable came from. It was a repeatable process to help you with your packing, to help you streamline your packing and to help make it easier on you when you're flying with a carry on. And the reason there's no E on the end of repeatable is because Back when I started this nearly seven years ago now, and I was coming up with all these ideas, I was having a lot of fun with it, um, I wanted the name repeatable, I wanted in the logo for it to be like the phonetic spelling, right? You know when you look up how to pronounce a word in the dictionary, it gives you the phonetic spelling. And for the word repeatable, there's no E on the end in the phonetic spelling of it. So I really wanted to do that. I thought that would look really cool and be a lot of fun. Um, but then as I got into this, I realized uh, that's gonna be kind of hard to spell out each time when I'm writing about it or um, how do I even type that out on the computer, right? And so I was afraid I was gonna lose people. So I dropped the phonetic spelling, but I kept repeatable without an E because I thought it was interesting, I thought it was fun, and it reminded me of back in the beginning when I started this and how, um, you know, how I was wanting to do something different to bring attention to the product I created. So that's really it, that's the story behind it. Um, if you have any questions or you wanna learn more about Repeatable, visit repeatabletravel.com or click, click the link in the description below.